Folks, I've set myself a bit of a goal to try <clears throat> and achieve over the course of the next 12 months. Um, and this is, it's not related to coronavirus or the state of the economy. Um, it's getting real clarity on what my own goals are. Um, I've been running the business now for 10 years. Um, I've certainly made huge improvements in how we operate as a business. Um, how we are systemized, the service that we deliver to clients um, and trying to develop a, a good culture um, with you know, really key areas that we're trying to help clients with on an ongoing basis. Um, but I think over the course, and, and maybe this is a lockdown thing in fairness, over the course of the last few months, um, I certainly did more sort of hands-on and rolling up the sleeves and getting stuck in type of work during the lockdown period because I felt it was necessary. And I was doing certain jobs and getting involved with clients and their compliance services a lot more than I'd be used to. Um, generally, I would have this kind of overview um, and maybe the, the general final review and, and meetings with clients. But certainly since um, coronavirus hit and, and people were working from home and so on, <clears throat> I felt I was uh, also in the mind for getting my hands dirty again. I haven't actually got out of that habit as much as I would care to admit over the course of the last sort of six or seven weeks. Um, but having watched some content to sort of re refresh myself, reinvigorate myself recently, I've set myself a goal within the next 12 months and this one, I mean, I've, I've set goals for our business in the past in terms of, you know, targets for monthly recurring revenue, developing targets for job turnaround times and, you know, levels of client service and so on. Um, this time I've completely moved on from that and I think it's the next logical step for me. Um, and the sooner most business owners can get into this space um the better their business and their life will become um and that is i want to essentially sack myself from all my current role and duties and tasks within the next 12 months and i want to reinvigorate um and inspire the team give them enough confidence and empower them enough with decision making tools that's going to allow them to do more of the things that i've got involved with again <clears throat> Kind of normal life as well, folks. You know, you slip into these habits. You you sometimes drift back in. It's important that you do realize that you're doing that and can step back out again. I tend to always take things that step further. Um, so I'm always looking for that extra bit of progress and that extra bit of development. And for me, um, I now need to sort of step back away from the business end of things, the operational side of things. Um, so what we're going to do, I've spoken to a number of the team members today. Um, I have one of them on holidays and we're going to have a chat probably Monday or Tuesday. Um, I then have somebody off in study day for a while. I'm going to take a few days off myself. But in between all of that, or, or in the aftermath of all of that, um, I think it's time to sit down and I have an idea what I'm going to do. And what I'm going to do is basically um, get a great big whiteboard out. I'm going to write down everything that I have sort of made notes of what I've been doing on a daily and weekly basis for the last while. Um, and I'm going to give it out to the rest of the team. It's up for grabs. And I'm asking them to take on the responsibility and not me delegate the responsibility. Um, I believe this is the, the, the way now to take our business to the next level. And in taking our business to the next level, it means not just that our business improves you know, financially and so on, but it's really about um, exceptional customer service more than we've ever done before. So it's really trying to, you know, excel at how much we can do for clients because I really think clients are going to need it over the course of the next six or 12 months. So we want to be fighting fit and ready for that. Um, and I also want to take over the role of business owner and business owner only. Um, certainly, I'll have the relationship with all of the clients and that will not change. Um, and I believe it, it can actually only improve so that it, instead of me getting stuck in and doing certain things, I simply direct and um, de deepen and develop the client relationships to allow the greater level of service that we can do um, to flourish and to help our clients through what may be a stormy period ahead. Um, but I'm certainly up for the challenge. 
the team that I've, the girls I've spoken to today are up for the challenge. Um, our new member of staff, who's called Jeff, um, I'll be talking to him within the next week or two as well, just about this. Jeff works remotely, so um, we'll, we'll have a chat about that. But I'm really up for it, and I just wanted to share that as an idea um, for other business owners, other accountants to have a think about it. Um, and I'll certainly report back as to how that's going over the course of the next over the of the next year. Um, so wish me luck and see you all on the other side.